and welcome to Mini Crafts for Little Hands. Today I'm going to show you how to make a crazy little paper sloth. So our theme for this month is tropical rainforest and the type of creatures that you might find inside. So let me show you what you're going to need to make your lovely little sloth. Some unusual things this time. I need you to have one of your shoes. This is my daughter's boot. We need a pair of scissors, a glue stick, a pen, preferably a dark one, and a pencil, a couple of googly eyes, if you have them. If not, just cut big circles in white paper and color in black dots. And then two different colors of paper. We've picked a nice dark, pinky red and then a paler pink like a skin colour but you could use anything you want you could go for browns and tans or oranges and blues whatever you fancy so let's get started you want to start off with your piece of paper and this is going to be for the body of your sloth and you can almost see now that that's a shoe shape and that's what we're going to that's why we need a shoe to draw around. So we set your shoe on top of your paper and you draw all the way around with your pencil. Then all you do is cut it out. Just like that. So now we've got our shoe shape. The next shape we want to cut out is the little face. So we're going to use our slightly paler colour of paper and we want to cut a nice oval shape out of it. You could draw it first, nice big oval, and then it makes it easier to cut out. So here we are, we've got a nice little oval shape and I'm going to use the glue to stick that down to create the little face. And then I'm going to stick down the eyes. So now I've got my eyes stuck down and my face. What I want to do next is to make it look like a sloth. I want to colour in black around the eyes, give them a nice little smile and maybe some hair at the top. So as you can see here I've drawn in some dark colours around the eyes, a little nose and a nice little smile. The next thing we're going to do is make his little arms. And what you need is to remember your piece of paper you cut your shoe shape out of. I'm going to cut two big long strips and those are going to be our two arms. So here are my two big long strips. And what I'm going to do is fold each of these in two and that creates a little arm and a little leg. And do that with both sides. Now all my little sloth needs is some little claws to hold on to. As you can see here, what I've used is the same colour that I've done the face. And I've just cut out little claws by doing zigzags into a tiny little square of paper. Now I have these nice little paws here. And what I'm going to do is stick those to the top of each of my little arms. Just like that, with a little bit of glue. And then we're going to stick them onto our sloth. So we turn our sloth upside down and we're just going to stick put a little bit of glue onto the bottom and onto closer to the head and we just stick that one down and then we stick his legs down. And it's starting to look oh, a little bit more sloth like now. So all we need now is a little branch for him to dangle off. So you can either, if you have it, use a lollipop stick, or if you don't, you can use your, your coloured paper, a bit of card. And I'm just going to use here a nice little bit of card, cut a long one in it, and I'm going to put a little bit of glue on either side of his paws so that he can stick onto his branch. I'm going to slip that in there. Close it down, and here we go. 
There you go. That's our little sloth dangling off a little tree. Please do share your little creations with us using the hashtag FE Art School. And I look forward to seeing you next week. Bye.